Bobby Rydell Biography Bobby was a singer and actor from the United States who mostly performed rock and roll songs. He was considered an adolescent idol in the early 1960s. Wild One and Volari are two of his most well-known tracks. Bobby Rydell Age Bobby was born on April 26, 1942 in Philadelphia, Pennsylvania, U.S. He died at the age of 79 years old. Bobby Rydell Parents Rydell Ridarelli was the son of Jenny Ridarelli and Adrio Ridarelli. Bobby Rydell Wife Rydell had two children with his first wife, Camille Quattroni Ridarelli, whom he married for 35 years from 1968 until her death in 2003. In 2009, he married Linda Hoffman. Rydell has been a resident in Penn Valley, Pennsylvania, for many years, living in the same residence from 1963 until 2013. Booby Rydell Death Rydell cancelled a trip to Australia in 2012 because his health had worsened considerably and he required immediate surgical surgery. On July 9, 2012, he had a double organ transplant at Thomas Jefferson University in Philadelphia to replace his liver and one kidney. Six months after undergoing double transplant surgery, Rydell returned to the stage in Las Vegas for a three-night performance to a sold-out crowd in January 2013. He continued to play overseas, and in 2014, he returned to Australia for a tour. Rydell died on April 5, 2022, at the age of 79, following pneumonia complications at Abington Jefferson Hospital. Bobby Rydell Career Bobby gained the spotlight when he won a talent show on a television series Paul Whiteman's TV Teen Club and gained a spot in the cast, where he remained for several years. His single Kiss in Time made the charts in 1959. We Got Love was his second hit. It was his first million copy sold album, and it was certified gold. His second million selling hit was Wild One, which was followed by Little Bitty Girl. He proceeded to release successful singles with Swing in School, which was supported by Ding A Ling, and Volari sold over a million copies later that year. In 1961, he was the youngest artist to headline at New York City's Copacabana nightclub. He performed in the Festival du Rock, held at the Paletta Sports de Paris in Paris, France, in February 1961. Rydell's success and prospects prompted his father, Adrio, a foreman at the Electronite Carbon Company in Philadelphia, to retire after 22 years to become an entrepreneur. Rydell released the song Wildwood Days in 1963, it reached number 17 on the Billboard Hot 100 chart and remained on the chart for nine weeks. His second success was We Got Love. It was his first million copy sold record, and it went gold. Wild One, his second million selling hit, was followed by Little Bitty Girl, and he went on to create big songs such as Swing in School, which was accompanied by Ding A Ling, and Volari sold over a million copies later that year. He was the youngest musician to headline New York City's Copacabana nightclub in 1961. In February 1961, he played at the Festival du Rock, which was held at the Paletta Sports de Paris in Paris, France. Adrio, a foreman at the Electronite Carbon Company in Philadelphia, retired after 22 years to become an entrepreneur as a result of Rydell's success and potential.